What's up everyone, it's Anna, also known as that Star Wars girl. I got a lot of requests to do a reaction to this new trailer, so I'm actually excited about this movie. Aladdin was one of my favorite movies growing up. Uh, I've done uh, cosplaying where I went to Disneyland dressed up in this Aladdin costume that my grandmother made you know, back in the early 90s for my cousin that was then hand me down to me. And I mean, I've always loved Aladdin. Who doesn't love Aladdin? That's such a great movie. And I got to meet the animator that designed Genie. So after what happened with Robin Williams, it really kind of just breaks my heart. And I know that Will Smith is going to play Genie because, you know, we don't have Robin Williams anymore. I actually really like uh, Will Smith. So I'm taking this with a grain of salt just because... I really like Aladdin. I grew up with it. I've seen some of the casting that they've done for this movie. I've never seen any of these actors, aside from Will Smith, in action. So I don't really know what to expect, but I am optimistic about it. So fingers crossed this is good. I've been really good about avoiding spoilers for this trailer. I know that something goes on with Genie, though. That's the only thing. So that's why I wanted to mention it. So without further ado, let's check this out. Also, I do apologize for my appearance. I just got out of the shower, so I apologize. Let's start this. All right. See Iago. I'm excited. All right, let's see. Okay, they're going in the desert. I really hope they have the music. I really hope Arabian Nights plays. Alright, Cave of Wonders! You know, no matter how much they try, it's never gonna look as good as the original. What? Your life begins now. What's wrong with his voice? <laughs> Aladdin. Okay. Why isn't he wearing purple? Let me pause that. What? <laughs> okay. I, I gotta rewatch that. Hold, give me a second. I gotta see Genie. Well, let's let's do that again. You really don't know who I am, Genie. I'm just waiting for the Fresh Prince of Bel-Air song to start. You know who I am in West Philadelphia. All right. Let let's just uh. All right. <laughs> well um. What's wrong with Jafar's voice? That that was a uh, was a little more high pitched than I thought it was gonna be. I Jafar has that like really sinister masculine voice. So I I don't know what that was. Abu? Are are they gonna have a? Uh, I don't know. I always liked Abu. I think he's so cute and charming. I also met the animator that designed Abu. He's actually left handed. Isn't that cool? I'll have to uh, go pull out those draw. They did drawings for me when I met them. It was really cool. I met them at CTN, which is a uh, Creative Talent Network. It's in Burbank, and it was really cool. I got he drew me a little sketch of a boo, and he said a boo loves you, and I was like, oh, so cute. So like I said, I have a really big attachment to Aladdin, and I mean, like a whole new world. That's such a magical song. It's like, oh, Aladdin. It's just such a good movie. So uh, I I don't want to judge this uh, trailer too harshly. I'm not a fan of the costumes. Let, let's just say that right now. The, so far, the worst thing about this is looking like the costumes. I don't know what the heck they're doing with Jasmine. Uh, th that does not look like Princess Jasmine. Aladdin, he wears purple. He, he's got a purple jacket and a red hat. That, that's what it is. Uh, it's okay. It's okay. Uh, I'm optimistic. I'm optimistic about this. Jeannie Will Smith looks a little ridiculous. Not even gonna lie, but... We're about to see Will Smith be a genie, but low-key, it looks like, uh, I feel like it's gonna be an episode of The Fresh Prince of Bel-Air where he wakes up from a dream and he's just like, whoa, I just had the weirdest dream, guys. <laughs> but anyway, guys, uh, thank you for recommending this. Fingers crossed it's good. Fingers crossed. Again, it's gonna be very hard to live up to, you know, what the animation was because 
Aladdin is one of the best movies I have ever seen. And I mean, even watching it as an adult, it's a cartoon. The animation is beautiful. The character design is, ugh. And Robin Williams, ugh. I mean, I don't want to cry, but Robin Williams was an amazing person. He was an amazing actor. And it, it I probably will cry. It broke my heart, you know, when the news came out about what happened to him. And one of the experiences I had was I, you know, I, I dressed up in my Aladdin costume and I went to Disneyland. And the cast members are always so good about keeping things magical and making sure you have an, a magical experience. And a lot of the characters that I would want to meet usually aren't there. Like, I, I've never met Pocahontas, and I love Pocahontas. And I had met, never met Genie. I'd met Aladdin, I'd met Jasmine. And so I really wanted to meet Genie. And it was really, it was right after Robin Williams passed. So I was in my costume, and Genie was there. And I think they brought him out because of what had happened. And so I'm at Disneyland. I'm in my costume, and I'm waiting in line to meet Aladdin and Jasmine and Genie. and Aladdin and Jasmine both see me, they see me in my costume, they all get excited, but they had to leave for the float, and the cast member that was talking to me that was in charge of line control, they're like, oh, I feel really bad that you're not going to get to meet Aladdin, I was like, it's okay, I've met Aladdin, I just want to meet Genie. and I had, like, I have, like, in a blue stuffed animal, I have the lamp, I actually have it, like, the little lamp, and so I went up, and, like, I saw Jeannie, and I went up to him, and I was like, oh, this is going to make me cry just saying it. But I had it, and I was like, Jeannie, you're free. And he got so excited, and he hugged me, and I, like, I cried a little bit. And it was it was such a magical experience, and the the person that was in the costume of Jeannie did such a good job. I, I know that they don't talk, but he, the way that he moved, it was so animated, and it was it was a very special experience. So... It's going to be difficult to watch this movie, I'm not going to lie, just because of how important it was to me growing up. And I know that a lot of people have their favorite movies and have their favorite moments. And Aladdin holds a very special place in my heart. So, uh, it, it's going to be really hard for this movie to live up to what the animation was. But that's just because of my own personal experience with it. Uh, everyone is different and that's fine. So everyone, if you like this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. If you didn't, that's okay too. Uh, and if you haven't already, go ahead and subscribe to my channel. Make sure you click that little bell. That way you get notifications when I put out other videos and when I do live streams because people tend to enjoy those. And everyone, have a great rest of your day. And may the force be with you because we are really, really going to need it. Bye.